Hey, good afternoon. This is Andy from Vehicle Fit. Um, just a quick demo of what we've done to this uh, Ford Custom. It's got a Ford factory alarm on it, so the Ford factory alarm doesn't cover any of this load area. It covers the doors, but if somebody needs to go through the door or the bodywork or the roof, which we have seen, we've also fitted high level deadlocks. But the a good addition to the um, Ford system is the Cobra 5462, 544, I think it's 5462, um, and that is the, well it's Cobra aftermarket micro sensor. Now this sensor fills the whole of the load area with um, hyper frequency waves. So we've also linked that into, run the cables along here and run that into an indicator, an indication LED. So this will tell you um, when the sensor is triggering. All it does is it senses movements. It throws a negative into the existing door circuit in the van, triggers this LED. We put a little diode in there as well to stop feedback from the door switch, keeping the LED permanently lit. So with a bit of jiggery poker, you've now got a very nice um, upgraded alarm system. The Ford system is category one, so it's battery backup, all doors, boot, bonnet, ultrasonic in interior protection. But what it lacks is uh, a penetration sensor in the load area. So it's a quick demonstration how we, uh, look how neat these locks are, look. Look how neat these keeps are. Um, a quick demonstration of how it works. What we'll do is we'll just uh, latch off the, uh, the rear door. And you'll see the LED just picked me up standing near the back. If I keep still, lock the van, deadlock it, and wait 20 seconds. That's about the time for the Ford system to arm. So there's no movement in here. The door's open. Uh, you could have a hurricane blowing through here. Microwaves do not detect air pressure. They don't detect, um, you know, stuff like that. What they detect is a disturbance in the sort of electromagnetic field. So anything conductive in the back of the van, be it a, a human or a you know crowbar being shoved in it will detect the electromagnetic field and trigger so at the moment van doors open it's not detecting me or the wind because i've not entered the detection zone if i just walk well, i'm just standing outside if i just walk towards the back of the van you'll see the blue led come on and the alarm trigger so that's turned on the fords it's basically it's, it's told the ford system the uh the van side door's been opened so disarm that and that'll just basically it's picking me up from the back door if i'm waving my hands here um moving towards it will detect actually outside the van uh, obviously it won't when the van door's shut because it'll bounce off the metal work of the van door as you see i walk close towards the van that's picking up so that's going to pick up any entrance to the top door peeling the side door peeling if they came through any body work it'll pick that up so again i'll show you that i'll stand outside the van Two or three foot away. One, two, lock the van, wait 20 seconds. So three minutes, 27. Wait till three minutes, 47. That's, I think it's 20 seconds roughly for the Ford system to arm. If it triggers within then, it just turns the uh, the van lights on in the back. So 40, 41, 42, wait till 47. And as soon as I enter the, the detection zone of the microwave, it will trigger the van alarm. So there we go. I'm just going to walk towards it now. There you go, perfect, absolutely perfect detection. Um, that's great, because when the van door's shut, all these microwaves will just bounce off, fill the whole van with a nice stable detection area. So any entrance through, any side panels through the roof, it will pick up and trigger that forward van. So yeah, the forward alarm's not bad. Um, it's category one, like I say, battery backup, ultrasonics, but it does lack a zone area we can fit an aftermarket alarm on top of the ford with an extra sounder extra sensors but to be honest if your budget's on a you know if you if you work into a budget not everyone could afford to spend a grand on security um it, it works quite well um and also another feature which i just realized happens when the van when the van lights turn, turn out sorry time out so if you're standing, if you've got the back door open, you're loading and offloading, working around the van, but not in the van, the Ford alarm, sorry, the Ford lights will turn off. <clears throat> so if you're, you know, 
on a big site somewhere that's quite secure, you left the van open like I have done now, you're offloading, you're loading gear. As you walk back towards the van, and it's unlocked, it'll turn the lights on for you. So I've just discovered a safety, uh, a convenience feature. So it's Ford aftermarket upgrade alarm microwave, and also, what should we call this? Um, automatic parametric user detection lighting system. <laughs> so yeah, basically, as I say, if you're out, if you're out working about in the winter, cold nights, you leave your van doors open, the Ford lights will time off. I'll show you this again. I know these videos drag on, but it's all about looking after your Fords. So let's just walk about a bit. <clears throat> so when these Ford lights turn off, if you're loading and unloading your van, so your back door is open, you've gone into your 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 your, your office or your house or your your premises that you're working on, you're loading stuff up. Go back in, lights time out. So you've got your, your bag of bits or your bit of wood. As you come back to the van, we're not pressing anything here. Um, as you come back to the van to load more materials, as you walk towards the back of the van, the lights turn on. So you can load your van and then go back again. Go and get some more stuff. You can repaint this forever. So I know on the sort the Ford Connects, I think some of the customers used to have problems with the lights drying in the battery quite badly. Um, I think it's because they used to keep the side lights on. I'm not sure they still do. I think they still do. But um, yeah, so these van, these Ford lights turn off. So you've now got a uh, user detection system for your lights. So here we go again. I've got my bag of tools, walk back up, load them in, plonk. Lights come on, I can see what I'm doing. There you go, so two features there. Security detection, load area, microwave, and convenience function of automatic light turning on system U L T O S Altos Vehicle Fit Altos trademark. Thanks for watching. Sorry, rattle on. Cheers, mate. Good luck.